breakfast on your athlete meals gains we already kind of pre-cooked the bacon got it going now we're going to add three or four whole eggs i usually like to uh, cook mine over hard add a little cheese at the end nothing too crazy but you know for the spirit of the video i'm going to show you normally what i do is use a little bit of butter or olive oil in the pan I basically pre-cooked the bacon just so you didn't have to watch me do that. Uh, once again, what I would do normally is I'll cook the bacon for a couple days. So that bacon will last me probably three mornings. And then I'll cook the eggs fresh each morning. So then it's like, not like I'm cooking, you know, day old eggs up. Once again, I am not a chef. I am a athlete bodybuilder that just eats what he needs to eat. So we'll get to some good recipes, but I'm trying to show you the bare basics. What I like to do is go with a little bit of red pepper flakes. Food is fuel, baby. A little bit of pepper and a little bit of salt. Just like that. So. We'll let these cook up where I'll separate them once I get a little bit white. And then I will add cheese after I flip them. So you can make them scramble over hard, dippy, whatever you want. The key is we're just doing protein and fat for breakfast, trying to keep our insulin stable. When your insulin is unstable, meaning when you eat a sugar and it spikes your insulin, that's when, when it dives is when you get tired. So what I don't want to do is have you eat breakfast, have you spike your insulin, and then you're tired at school, at work, or whatnot. Where this way, you're going to be energized, get the fuel, get the fat, get the things that you need to help with recover and repair and create that muscle. And then we'll give you the other stuff, the carb sources and the fruit later in the day. So we're going to let this cook up a little bit. That looks a little bit better than the first try, Kyle. <laughs> we're getting there. Once again, we're going to add, I'll have uh, Coach Myers. He is a much better cook than me. But I just want to show you guys literally the bare basics of how I do things. And once again, you could pre-cook the bacon. You cook it in the air fryer. You cook it in the oven, however you want to do it. You know, make your eggs probably more each day fresh. Eat them, smash them real quick and then head out the door. Um, meal one, super simple, pretty inexpensive, easy for you guys to follow. Um, trying to think if there's anything else. I think that's pretty much it. I don't know if you guys want to watch me finish these all the way. I think what we should do, Kyle, is do like one of them speed up things right now. So you can watch it and then I'll catch you in a second. All right, back from the speed up part. Now we're gonna add our cheese. So then I'll just add to the top of it, like so. Let it melt on there for a second. And as you're, kind of keep it like that. And then I'll plate it. It'll continue to melt because everything's hot. Obviously add the pieces of bacon that already have maybe a little bit of egg on them. So I'd say somewhere three or four pieces of bacon. Pick one more. Come on. Watch me struggle here. Boom! That actually looks pretty good! It might have looked a little rough on the way, but this is Good, I'm telling you, this is muscle food right here. And that'd be breakfast.